Hello, this is your girl Pathology, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Make sure you like and subscribe. Make sure you click that notification button so you know exactly when I'm uploading new content. I'm on VU today, and I'm going to teach you guys how to make slides. But they're not going to be just any type of slides. These are transparent slides. Now, you can use whatever steps that I use to make your products transparent, if you choose to do so. I usually just do it with shoes heels slide slippers i don't really do it with anything else but it is possible to do it with other items am i a pro at doing transparent items no i am not but i will say that my items that i have done that were transparent have sold i have over 300 plus sales and that landed me on second page which is not bad you type in slides you're gonna see my slides which is right here on the second page which is really really good I've made tons of credits from the this this product that I made so this is good this is a good start um, but I'm gonna teach you guys how to make transparent items and I'm gonna start with slides because it's the easiest thing to do so let's get started make sure you have your GIMP opened up and Google opened up because we're gonna see exactly what type of items we might want to look at for some inspiration so we're in google i typed in jelly slides and i'm going to scroll down and show y'all different ones these are giving me 90s vibes and i just like the 90s era of fashion anyway so this is actually really cute these are really really nice and they're simple and you can't go wrong with that these are really really cute and as you can see, I was inspired by the Chanel slides here. And that's how I ended up with the sliders that I made. Hello. So, this is just giving you guys some inspiration, some ideas on what you can do. But these are actually really cute. I like these a lot. You're very fashion forward too. Okay, so we got an idea. Now let's go and look at who I derived from. So one of my favorite people to derive from is Manila. They always have amazing textures, as you can see. And this is who I derived from originally. So you have the nails over here and you actually have the slides over here so it's pretty simple i'm glad that it's separate because sometimes when you go and look for sandals or slides the nails are with the actual texture of the sandals i don't like that at all but i like that this is separate so you only need to download two pieces and you come down here the product id number is at the bottom or you can click derive from product up to you all right, let's go and get and get started. So we are in GIMP and I uploaded two of the textures that are needed for the slides. Now I will be coloring these nails. Now I like to do a white, so I'm just gonna go to Hue Chroma. there so it looks chromish looking but it's not bad I don't really want to focus too much on the nails but I will be overriding that and export now with the slides I want to go a different route I'm thinking like a hot pink so let's see what that would look like I'm going to do colorize this time. Even blue looks really nice. All 
I actually really like this color. There. I, I really, really like this color. This color is beautiful. And I'm going to overwrite the slides. Now, if you want to add anything extra to it, or if you don't even want to color them, you want to just add a texture to it, you already know what to do. You would right click here and click new layer and then add whatever texture and then just, you know, play with the opacity back and forth to see what you like more. You don't want to get rid of any of the wrinkles. You don't want to get rid of any of that. You want to make sure it looks actually authentic and real. Okay, so we got that out the way. It's pretty, it's pretty simple. If you decide to put a logo here, you can put a logo here. You don't have to if you don't want to, but if you want to, you can do that. I'm not going to put a logo. I just want to show you guys something super simple and easy to do. So let's go into VU. We are in VU right now, and I'm going to show you guys exactly what slides look like there. And now I'm going to change the texture. And then I'm going to do the same with the nails. And apply changes. So that's what it looks like and save. So you're probably wondering, how do I get this product to be transparent? Well, it's pretty simple. Pretty, pretty simple, but this is actually really nice. So over here, the opacity map, you want to make sure in either you could either find texture colors in Google or you can do them yourself in GIMP. So I have downloaded textures in Google. These are different types of grays. That's what you're going to be using. So you're going to click on the opacity map. As you can see, I have different types of grays here. Let's go with this type of gray, which is a darker gray. And I, you click on use blending and apply changes. Wow, not bad, huh? Super easy. So you always want to have a different type of grays downloaded in order for you to do this. Very simple and easy. These are clear slides. And that's pretty much it. That's how you do it. This is how you get transparent items. It's not going to always be this easy. Some people mess up and, you know, they, they ended up with, half of their body gone <laughs> so it, it takes practice you want to actually in order for you to not mess up on something you really like you want to duplicate all these just in case you mess up on the first one you could just exit out of the first editor and then you know do the second one and practice and try again it's not you're not going to always get it right on the first try but this is how you make transparent shoes very simple, easy, and cute. And the, this is giving me 90s vibes, but I really like this product. And hope you, hopefully you guys like it too. Make sure you check out my shop, Uncritical. And I will see you guys next time for the next video. And make sure you guys like and subscribe and comment. Please comment down below if you have any questions or concerns. I get back to people super quick. Thank you guys for watching the video and have a nice day.